Hi guys, this is Sadek from Robin.com and in this video, we'll show you how to exit the no command screen on any nothing phone. At the time of recording, the nothing phone 1, phone 2 and phone 2a have been released but in the near future, when the nothing phone 3, phone 4 and subsequent phone will be released as well, then the steps will be same for all the, the nothing phone and if there is something change or if the new rule applies, then I'll make a new video but as of now there is no such hint and this video is applicable across all the nothing phones so when your phone gets stuck in the no command screen well one of the most common cases is when you try to boot to the stock recovery for example if you use the adb reboot recovery command after enabling usb debugging your phone will try to boot to the recovery but before that it will automatically end up in the no command screen so let me show you, I've just used the ADB reboot recovery command in the CMD window which is open inside the platform tools directory. Now you could see instead of booting to the stock recovery, it will end up in a no command screen. Let me show you that as well. So as you could see, it's the Android logo with a no command screen. So in order to rectify this issue, well it's not exactly an issue, but let's call it an issue for the time being. So what you have to do is press and hold the power button and while holding the power button, Press and release the volume up key after around 4 to 5 seconds. So press and hold the power button and while holding the power button, press and release the volume up key after a few seconds and you will now be inside the stock recovery. So press and hold the power button and then press and hold the volume up key as well for around 4 to 5 seconds and then let go of the volume up key and finally let go of the power key as well. So you are now inside the stock recovery as you could see. And you will now use the volume key to highlight the required option and press the power key to confirm. For example, you are if you choose apply update from ADB, then press the power key and your phone is now in the side load mode. Let me show you. And now you could simply use the first verify the connection via ADB devices and you should get the side load as you could see. And now you may do the side load of the required zip file, ADB side load, ROM dot zip, or anything of your choice. And once that is done, you may simply reboot your phone to the OS. So guys, that's just about it. If you have any queries with regard to any of the steps, do let me know in the comment section. And thanks a lot for watching.